Hey YouTube, this is Brilla Gossam, and today we're going to make the herringbone domino chain. Now some people won't even consider this a machine trick, but this was invented by Doodle Chaos a while ago and hasn't even resurfaced, but I think it's a really cool trick and it's definitely worth showing you, and it's pretty easy to make, so here's how you do it. So all you need for this is a bunch of Jenga blocks, a bunch of popsicle sticks, some dominoes, and a block as a weight. So the first thing you're going to do is to count up all of your Jenga blocks, in my case that's 25. Then you're going to take half of them minus 5, so that's 10 for me, and you're going to line them up in a domino fashion, like this. Then you're going to leave out 5, and with the rest of them, you're going to line them up like this, perpendicular to the first Jenga blocks, like so. Now you'll have 5 remaining. And with one of them, you're going to take it and put it in the middle like this. And you're going to take one stick, place it on two Jenga blocks, the one in the middle, and another one. You're going to take another stick, place it on the first stick, and another Jenga block. And you're going to take a third stick, and put it on the second stick, and another Jenga block. And make sure it's not touching any other Jenga blocks and will not fall on any other Jenga blocks. And you're going to continue doing this. And now you've arrived at the last Jenga block. Now for this Jenga block, we're going to put two sticks onto it and onto the stick that was previous to it. Make sure these sticks aren't on top of each other. And on top of that, we're going to add a weight. Now what this weight will do is to keep the dominoes from falling, or the Jenga blocks from falling, before anything falls on the sticks. So what we're going to do now is to take the remaining four Jenga blocks and lean it on this one. One, two, three, and four. Now when this weight falls, this Jenga block will also fall, triggering the domino effect. And now we're going to connect everything with dominoes. Now that we've connected it with dominoes, here's what's going to happen. The dominoes will push this Jenga block, which will let the first stick fall, and that will set a chain reaction of all the sticks falling, which lets this weight fall, which makes all of these Jenga blocks fall in the fashion of dominoes, hitting these dominoes and connecting out of the idea. So here it goes. And that's the herringbone domino trick.